Hello everybody. A warm welcome to sunny Finland, to Espo Otaniemi. My name is Päivi Kalske from Nokia and I'm delighted to welcome you to our next 5G in Action live update. Today here we have in Otaniemi Alta University, European Society International Telecommunication Society's 30th meeting uh, with the theme Connected Society and Automated Society. So is there a better place to talk about 5G than here today with, with all the experts present? I'm extremely delighted to welcome here our client, Telia Finland, Janne Koistinen, who heads the 5G program at uh, Telia Finland, as well as Raja Lilius from Nokia. Raja is project manager for our 5G trials and, uh, and pilots. So Janne, what's spe special about today? Why are we here in Otaniemi today? Well, this is, uh, this is a great day. This is uh, one of the days I've been waiting for and expecting for some time already. Um, this is the first time uh, in, in the world we are, we are uh, running a what we call a pop-up 5G network here. So, so this whole network setup uh, um, is, uh, has been built here for, for today. It's a, um, a tool for network operators to complement the macro network uh, services uh, with, with the very unique way that, way that the 5G can, can bring us. Um, Raya, please, t tell us what, what do we have here. So what, what's the network that, that, we, that we are running here today? So we came here yesterday and, and set up this network quite quickly. So we have here uh, Nokia Indoor Solution, uh, a Pico RRH here, that enables the uh, uh, operators and enterprises mm -hmm. to create uh, indoor solutions. 5G indoor solutions, all there's, kinds of environments. There's, there's a lot of uh, a talk uh, in, in public and, and uh, amongst the experts that whether 5G is suitable for indoors or whether it's just in a macro outdoor network. But the, the, uh, this is the proof point, 5G is for indoors. It's, uh, yeah. it's, uh, it's great to see that, that we finally have all the tools that network operator needs to, to, to make sure that the network service, the 5G network service can be made available anywhere uh, anytime with, with, this, with, this, with this technology. Yes, and additionally we have here uh, the baseband uh, solution, the Nokia Airscale uh, system module that can work together with this uh, small cell solution mm -hmm. as well as mm -hmm. then the macro uh, network. Yeah. And uh, additionally we have a core network. So this uh, network here is a private net 5G network that enables, the, for example, the enterprises to create their own 5G networks. And this, this is uh, of a sense to, to me as, as a service provider that, that I can, I can complement my macro network service offering with the, with the uh, local networks. That, that all the things that, are, that I need are in, in one, one box I can deliver to customer premises and set up the whole network environment uh, as, as, we, as we see it today, as a pop-up yeah. for temporary. <laughs> but then of, then of course, the, 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 uh, uh, it's, it's not just about the pop-up networks, it's, uh, it's also about creating uh, um, uh, isolated or dedicated network environments, right? Yeah. So, so uh, uh, what we often call as a private networks, that's uh, of course something that the, the, uh, I'm so delighted to, to see that I finally have the, the uh, tools in, in the portfolio that I can use for, for doing this. But hey, how, 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 do we then, how do we then connect? to the 5G network. I mean, people don't have yet the 5G phones or 5G devices in, in large extent. Yes, so here we have a Nokia Fast Mile home router that enables to connect to the 5G network and provide Wi-Fi service uh, for the users. It can co yeah. also connect to the macro network, but here we use it um, as a 5G UE to connect to the small cell network here in the uh, conference. And this, this, is, uh, this is exactly what, what I need as a service provider. I, I need to, to have uh, solutions to, to go from macro to local and private networks of this kind of pop-up networks and then let people move freely and experience the same network service, the best network service all over, regardless of whether it's a, it's a, it's a macro or, or local network service. Mm -hmm. But uh, how, do, how do I then show to my, my customers that uh, what, what is the service that, what, what is the, the local network, the private network service that they are experiencing? How, how does it work? How, how do I show it to them? So, uh, for example, the uh, enterprise customers, they 
yeah, let me have see, let me possibility see well. yeah. to use this kind of user interface where you can see the network status, you can see um, your sites yeah. and, and their yeah. availability. Just it's by all there, it's all there. Using an internet connection, you're able yeah. to see the status of your enterprise network and uh, this provides kind of uh, insurance that your network is working fine. Yeah, that's absolutely great. And the, the, uh, often people kind of associate the uh, um, monitoring the network uh, or the, its performance as a kind of a big IT system in the back office or some operation like that. But hey, I can have it in my in my phone as well. So that's yes. pretty cool. <laughs> I, 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 I can I can give it to my customers and say check it out on your own phone. And that's everyone has perfect. a phone in their back pocket, so yeah. they can easily yeah. check what is the status of their network. Yeah. All oh, right. This is this is absolutely great stuff. What we are doing here. Yeah. World's yeah. first 5G pop-up network. Isn't that great? <laughs> yeah. yeah, it is. <laughs> These are Finns being enthusiastic. I mean, it's it's fantastic. Thank you, Janne and, and Raya, for sharing this very special moment with us. World's first 5G pop-up network. I can I can feel the excitement, and we're really delighted at Nokia to be working with our customers uh, to bring 5G to life. Uh, also bringing the security and, and the peace of mind to the subscribers that with Nokia equipment are, are designed for security from the outset. If you'd like to hear more about Nokia's uh, fully in-cloud, end-to-end 5G portfolio available globally around the world, please check into nokia.com slash 5G, read our blogs at nokia.com slash blog, and of course, follow us in social media on LinkedIn, Twitter, Facebook, uh, we chat uh, and Twitter, of course. Thank you so much for joining us here in today in 5G in Action Live Update. See you again soon.